All right, and we should be going. Hey, YouTube, what's going on? Game Art here with a brand new Let's Play of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. I am so excited this game finally came out. I've been waiting for God knows how long for this to come out. And now it's here. And now we get to play it. And we'll also be playing it with the Pokeball Plus. And I, I know I just went past this, and the second it said begin game, I wanted to start rolling with this Let's Play, but... I had a little tutorial about this Pokeball Plus. I now learned that the center button is A, and the button on top is B. I learned that out real quickly. So, alright, so with that in mind, I think we're ready to go. Begin game. So, full disclosure, I haven't played this yet. I have no idea what's about to happen. Hello there! Glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People affectionately refer to me as the Pokemon Professor. We know who you are. He's got a Cubon. Not a Tauros, huh? This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. And if you want to know how people tend to interact with these Pokemon, well, some people keep them as companions, other have them... Alright, as for myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. Well, now I have the cue to keep going. Okay. Now, why don't you tell me about yourself? Let's do that. What do you look like? Well, uh... Do I get to edit it, or are those, like, the, the predefined choices? I guess I look like that. And how about a name, huh? Yes! Let's give myself a good name. Whoa, this is trippy. Alright. So I gotta be very careful how I'm holding this Pokeball Plus. Ah! B. Alright. Sorry guys, this may take a while to get used to. If this ends up being... A4. That's my name. If this ends up being too difficult, I may... Switch back to little Joy Cons. And I don't have plus. I don't think I do. Okay. So my name is Art, yes. Yeah, I guess I don't get to edit myself that much. Not yet. Oh, this guy. What are we gonna call this guy? It's come with a predefined name. This boy here is your friend and rival, who has grown up right next door to you. What is this name now? I think it's Blue? But, I think we learned that there is an actual Red, Blue, and Green already in this game, so this guy isn't Blue. Who are you? What is your rival's name? I don't know. I had a feeling this was going to happen. I would name him after a color, after one of the versions. I don't have a good one in mind. I can't just call him Pikachu or Eevee. Yeah, sure. Let's go with Cody. My rival's name is Cody. Mm-hmm. I see. His name is Cody. Art, my boy. Your very own Pokemon tale is about to unfold. Yes, a world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. Yes. Let's go. I see what you did there, Nintendo. I have a Switch. And a PC. Alright. I have the red-blue Joy-Cons, it looks like. That actually looks like one of the TVs I own. Alright, so now I get to move, right? Do I get to click on anything? Can I just go back to bed? <laughs> oh. Many Pokemon are in the world? 800 something, but this game would have you believe there's only 153? There's an email from Cody. Hey, Art. Here's what you need to know as a trainer. Press the A button and you can talk to all kinds of people, and if you tilt the control stick more, you can run. That was a bad place to scroll but down for more. <laughs> Plus, if you open up the main menu by pressing the X button, you can save your progress too. 
Boy, I can't wait to get started, can you? Cody. Alright, and I have a little peek. I'm guessing the Eevee edition, it's an Eevee? Oh, and I just noticed the, um... The uh, poster up on the wall is of the original battle that used to play as the start screen for uh, Pokemon Blue and Red. Ah, that's a nice little throwback. And the, the calendar is of one of the, um, the images they used to have for the Pokemon, too. Neat. I like those little throwbacks. It's a fluffy Pikachu plush. So nothing else. Can I click on the TV? It's a Nintendo Switch. It's connected to the TV. Better pee. <laughs> Can I go outside? Is that a... Ah, quit, quit clicking on the world. Is that... Out, can I go outside? Not yet. What is that? Is that just a window? Because it looks like a sliding screen door. Which would lead me to believe there's a balcony. Which is pretty baller. My room has a balcony. I'm coming up. Up and at him. Morning, Art. Yeah, just let yourself in. I like how the stairs go right into the room. There's like no landing or anything. <laughs> What's going on? You've got one weird look on your face. Ah, uh, never mind that. I couldn't wait any longer, so I came to get you. Today's finally the big day. We're finally going to get our first Pokemon from Professor Oak and become real trainers. Oh, but before we do... You read the email I sent you yesterday, right? Sure did. Because I leave no stone unturned. Or at least I try not to. You'd better have. Check your computer if you didn't. Already did, so let's go. I'm gonna book it to Professor Oak's lab, so see you there. I feel like we didn't really need to read that email. It's a little unnecessary, but whatever. Wow, I need to... I keep wanting to tilt this Pokeball in my hand, but every time I do and then try to use the joystick, I start moving in the wrong direction. So I have to learn, just hold it in place. It's like, I need it to, like, gyro the the whatever the gyro whatever to know like no matter how i hold this thing if i tilt right i want to go right whatever cha -cha 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 -cha. oh i guess there's the mother off you go to professor rook's lab cody asked the professor to give the two of you a pokemon of your own didn't he well, that would be sweet if he had any left Red and blue didn't take everything. Alright, so we got a TV down here. Like looks like a little Blu-ray DVD plate. Or a Xbox, maybe. Right. Could be anything, I guess. I don't know. Anything in the fridge? No. Dishes? No. Oh, ah! Dishes and plates are neatly lined up. Like they should be. Alright, let's go outside. Pallet Town looks nice. Almost did it again. Almost rotated this in my hand. Any mail? My house. Yep. Oh, this is going to be difficult trying to find hidden items just constantly. Oh, just having to move until... just. Uh, <laughs> I want to play with this thing all the way through, but I can see how it's going to be a little bit of a hindrance here and there. Can we just go straight to Cinnabar Island? Uh, that would be sweet. I'm raising Pokemon too. When they get strong, they'll be able to protect me. Yes, they will. What's this sign say? Pallet Town, shades of your journey await. Nothing. What are you doing? Technology is incredible. It is. Now you can connect your smartphone to your game console and send data between them. And we shall. Yes, I will be looking forward to that later on. Uh, transmitting Pokemon from my Pokemon Go app to this game. Uh, especially to get Meltan. At some point, I do want to get a Mel Metal, I think it's pronounced. At some point, I want a Mel Metal on this team. But I think I need 400 Meltan candies to even get that far. So, uh, if I get one by the time this Let's Play is over, then I will make a video and come back and transfer it and show it off a little bit. Um, but yeah, I think having a Steel Pokemon in this game is really going to rock out. Maybe not against the uh, Fire types, but I think Steel would do really good against uh, Kanto Gems. Let's see. It would do good against Brock. Misty, not so much. Maybe not so great against Lieutenant Surge, but then Erica and 
Yeah, everyone then except for Blaine, I think. Um, yeah, Steel types would just rock out. Yeah, he would. Yeah, Steel types would go great against Koga. I need a Steel type. <laughs> Too bad you can't get one unless you want to transfer uh, a Lowland Sandshrew or Sandslash, or if you want to rock out with a Magnemite on your team. But if you have the Let's Go Pikachu edition, you already have an Electric type. The so odds are you're not going to have a Magnemite. I also study Pokemon as Professor Oak's assistant. Do you really? See, he's got... He's a ward? Professor Oak may not look like much, but he's the authority on Pokemon. Many Pokemon trainers think highly of him. As they should, he's the first professor we were ever introduced to. I also study Pokemon as Professor Oak's assistant. You all study Pokemon. Want to be more specific? Or is that... Hey, hey, hey! There's Pokemon for us? They are in a mysterious machine. It's a picture of Professor Oak. He's smiling in front of an impressive building. Ah, huh, what building would that be? What you got for me, Cody? Oh, alright. Professor Oak isn't here. Do you think those Pokeballs hold the Pokemon you and I are supposed to get? I can't wait to get mine. There's only two left. Professor Oak better hurry. I want my Pokemon before uh, some other trainer comes along and gets theirs. And I gotta wait for next year. Alright. So this must be Cody's house. So, yeah, I just want you to know, for those of you watching, I have played Pokemon Red, Blue, Yellow before. I do know where I'm supposed to go, but I do want to explore. And that's something that I'm going to be doing in this Let's Play, is exploring around, rather than just trying to speedrun this thing. So, I, I'm just curious what is in each of these houses. Oh, hi, Art. Looking for Cody? He went to pick you up. Did you miss each other? He said that he was going to go to Professor Oak's lab with you. <sighs> he didn't wait for me. Wait, so he has no bedroom? You guys just, uh, sleep out here? Alright. No bedrooms. But there's a second floor. And it has a balcony. Look, there's a second floor up here, and he's got a balcony. All right, I got a balcony too. Never mind. I was, I was about to say, I'm the I'm the one with doors that go outside off to the side. Ah, oh, I wonder if there's something up there, like a hidden item. If this were Pokemon Blue or Red, there'd be rumors everywhere that you can get Mew if you go up there. Anybody remember the uh, the legend of Gary's backyard? I think was one of the rumors. <laughs> All right. So, let's do this. Well, my good Pidgey, thanks for the help. I thought they were attacking you, not helping you. <laughs> Professor Oak's just so awesome. He's just got wild Pokemon helping him out for the goodness of their hearts. I think I understand you all a bit better now, thanks to this. Ah, if it isn't art. Oh, of course. I promised to give you and Cody your Pokemon today, didn't I? Well, in that case, why don't we head over to... Pikachu! Hmm? Oh, what's this? Aha! Uh -huh. Now that is a rare Pikachu, because it can learn... What is it? Floaty Fall? It can learn all kinds of crazy moves. That is a Pikachu worth Team Rocket Steel. Just saying. My, my, I surely wouldn't have expected a Pikachu to appear around here. Neither would I. But since the opportunity has presented itself, why don't we practice some Pokeball to catch it? Yes. You just have to throw out your Pokeball and try to land it on a wild Pokemon for the chance to catch it. All right, here we go. So hold Joy-Con horizontally. Oh, great. I have to hold this even more precisely now. And point it straight at the screen. The instructions for the Pokeball Plus. Your Joy-Con pointing at the screen. Press the A button to raid the Pokeball. Alright. Alright. So I have 10 tries to land this. Get ready. So hold it. You can throw your Pokeball waving your Joy-Con. Oh, I... Just don't forget the surroundings as you... get. Yeah, hope, hopefully I don't just throw this thing. Alright. And... Go. 
All right, so there's a little bit of a delay. Yeah, Pikachu is mine. Oh, that's cool. I don't know if you guys saw that, but this thing just lit up and I heard Pikachu come out of it. I like that feature. By the way, I don't know if I... That's a pretty fine performance for the first time on my boy. By the way, I don't know if I was holding that perfectly or if it even matters holding this. But I, li I don't know if you saw it, but I was just... <laughs> I'll, f I'll figure it out. That was a pretty fine performance for the first time on my boy. <laughs> Why don't you pick up that Pokeball and give the Pikachu you caught a name? I think I'm just going to leave him as Pikachu. Uh... I'm not so much into the nicknaming. Now that's a lively Pokemon if I ever seen one. Darn tootin' he's lively. Whoa. I suck as a trainer already, because I just caught this thing, I have no badges, and it just ran away. Wow. Hey, wait, come back! Did it just run to get on that table? Listen, I know you're going to pick one of these Pokemon, but I want you to pick me, as I put myself in the middle. <laughs> Professor Oak, those Pokeballs there, I swear there were only two a second ago, but now there are three. A perfectly reasonable reaction, my boy. You see, one of them is a Pikachu that Art caught just now. So wait, Art, you caught it yourself? Yep, that one right there. Well, uh, I've never seen that happen before. Ho ho ho, how interesting. Well, my boy, this is it. Take that Pokeball and keep a good hold of it this time. Uh, ah, I know, I know, I know. I'm still getting used to my controller. What if I went for one of the other ones? Would they stop and say, whoa, whoa, just one, man. Just one. That's awesome. Yeah. Pikachu, me and you are going to wear so many crazy outfits in this game. I'm s I am so glad our character has facial expressions. I don't know why that wasn't a thing until now. Hmm. What a strange Pokemon indeed. It sure doesn't seem to like staying in one place. But it looks as though it's taken a shine to you, Art. Why not give it a name? I don't want to give it a name. Mm, let me try the B. Yeah, B. Pikachu has been added to the party. And let me guess, he stays there. This, this is going to be one overpowered Pikachu. Um. <laughs> like, I can't... I, I don't know if I can take it out of the party to level up other Pokemon, so this thing's going to be getting all kinds of crazy experience share experience. And then what if I don't have the gym badge? Is it just going to stop listening to me once it hits a certain level? Professor, I choose this one. Do you choose Eevee? Yep, Cody got an Eevee from Professor Oak. Can, can I have both? I want Pikachu and Eevee. Oh, wait. So I think normally this is where... Oh, that's so awesome. I think this is normally where the rival would challenge me. But I don't think that's the case here. Oh, just one more thing. Now that you two are setting out as trainers, I'd like to ask your help with something. This is, take this with you on your journeys. Is it the Pokedex? Or do you need us to go get it again? What is that thing, Professor? This is the Pokedex that I've designed. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught, and it makes an entry for each. It's an extremely high-tech tool. Does it have a Rotom? Because if it don't have Rotom, you know what? <laughs> Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon, I am done with Rotom being unhappy. I, I hope it doesn't have Rotom in it. <laughs> Art and Cody, I want you each to take one with you. Got the Pokedex. Didn't even have to go get his parcel. You'll find you can't get very detailed data on Pokemon just by seeing them. You must catch a Pokemon to gather the most complete data to make a complete guide to all the Pokemon in this world. That was my dream. But I'm an old man now. Too old to get the job done myself. 
That's why I want you young trainers to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. A Pokedex, huh? We're gonna meet so many Pokemon, this keeps getting better and better. I'm setting out right now. Art, you should do the same. If you think you're ready, that is. Oh, we are ready. We've been, made, we've been waiting since, I don't know, E3? Whenever this thing first got shown, we are ready. Oh, oh, what's the mother? Oh, <laughs> check it out. Oh, how cute. This is the one you got from the professor. What? You caught it yourself? That's amazing. I know, it was one shot, too. What should I call your new friend? Pikachu? It's a lovely Pokemon. Pikachu! My, how energetic. I suppose that means you two will be setting off on an adventure today, right? I thought this day might come soon, so I planned ahead and got this for you. Town map, all right. That'll, that'll come in handy. Put it in my bag. By using that town map in your bag, you always knew exactly where you are. Safe travels, dear. You and Pikachu be good to each other. Hmm. All right, let's let's do this. So we can we can leave, right? Does does the rival sister still give you something? Let me check. All right, I heard both you and Cody got a Pokemon. I'm happy for you. All right, don't give me anything. I think before she gave you the town map. And I think maybe people missed out on that. All right, so, oh, there's a Pidgey. <laughs> I had 10 Pokeballs. I had 10 Pokeballs, and I caught this Pikachu, so I have nine. Oh, that's so cool. What, what? Oh, there's a Pidgey noise. Hey, dude. See those ledges along the road? It's a bit scary, but you can hop down from them. You'll get back to Palatown quicker that way. And, oh, an Oddish? Hey, I want an Oddish. Get ready for the first gym. All right, let's do this. Oddish appeared. Oh, you encountered a wild Oddish. All right, let's do this. So I want to see bag. What do we have in the bag right now? Just I have 50. Dude, sweet. I have 50. It's a level four CP 16. I think we can do this. Oh. <laughs> Excellent, yeah. You better stay in that ball. Yeah! Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's cool. So bonus multiplier 2.4. New Pokemon. Excellent throw techniques. That's cool. I get a rat. Oh, so you get... If you do, I guess, bonus... So you get items on catching, maybe. Do you get more Pokeballs this way? That's the one thing I wondered. How do you get Pokeballs in this? Because it's mostly about catching Pokemon. But I don't think they have Pokestops like they did in Pokemon Go. That's, that really like bugs me. Like, how do you get? It's all about catching Pokemon, but you need Pokeballs, but you have to buy them. But it's not so much about battling, but that's how you get the money. I'm sure it will reveal its mysteries to me soon. That's cool. 34. The Oddish data will be added to the Pokedex. That's cool. Oh, does it keep my record? Oh, it's awesome. Add it to the party. By the way, I don't know that I'm going to keep an... I better step out of this grass. <laughs> I don't know that I'm... You leave me alone, Pidgey. I don't know that I'm going to keep this Oddish in the party necessarily, the, the entire Let's Play. Odds are, I'm going to be trying to figure out what Pokemon do I want uh, to keep around. Now let's catch a Pidgey. Um, so at times, it may seem like I have a full team, but really, uh, I might just keep Pokemon in the party just so they get the experience. Um, so I can fill the Pokedex and go! Oh, oh, it actually tracks. Alright, this is interesting. It's too short. So this is tracking how hard do I throw the ball. Alright, I'm just losing Pokeballs. Alright. This is gonna be tricky as oh heck. I don't know if I like that or not.
All right. Sweet. Level up. And <laughs> he learned Quick Attack. That's, that's awesome. By the way, I don't plan on making a uh, competition team. Um, like, like for a battling and whatnot. Yeah, competitive is the word I'm looking for. I'm not planning to make a competitive team. Uh, specifically because these games aren't supposed to be competitive, from what I gather. I caught a Pidgey, man. I caught a Pidgey. Can I talk to Pikachu? He's staring at it. Yeah, let's call his name. <laughs> Alright, little buddy. Respond energetically. Oh, look at that. Well, I have to catch... I know there's going to be so many Rattatas. But I have to catch a Rattata. Nothing over here. I have to do it for the sake of... Uh... Come here, Rattata. Alright. Oh, oh. Yeah, get closer. Don't have to throw as far. Oh, come on. I definitely threw... Alright, I have to really put... Alright, line it up. So that might be a little bit better. I have to really play around with this and practice. Up, up, up. Yeah. <laughs> I have to really play around with this. I'm sure, as you notice, I suck at throwing this Pokeball right now. Alright, alright. It, it's nothing special. Everybody's been there. Had to catch a Rattata. Alright, Pikachu. What do you got for me? You, you had. I think you point out. Where is it? What'd you find? What'd you find? Raspberry! Ah, yeah, sweet. What do you got, Youngster Joey? You've got a pretty sweet Pokemon with you. I'll bring along my favorite Pokemon later, so you'd better battle me when I do. What does he get? Like a rat Rattata, I think? Alright, and we made it to Viridian City. Alright, so I think this is a good place to end off episode one of our Let's Play. So, if you enjoyed today's episode, please hit that like button, support the new channel, all that good stuff. Um, next time, I will continue with Viridian City, maybe make it to, I think it's Route 2, is uh, what's north of Viridian City. And hey, maybe we'll also battle our rival next episode. So alright, I'll see you guys then. Later.